Hello everyone, welcome to this video and today I want to show you how to make hotkeys in Android emulator Nox. Yes, unfortunately it is only on PC, but this way is three times faster than to do it by hand. Let me show you how it works. For example, I click the key 1 and Phalanx very fast swapping to infantry. Then I close the window and click for example 2. This is range wedge for me and also I have a cavalry phalanx. This is a set for my rally trap, I'm using uh, this there and it works as you see very very fast. I didn't change the phalanx in time only once because of uh, game lag. Yeah, my English is not so good as uh, it should be for such videos, but I hope you will understand me and I will try to explain how to set the macro. First of all, you need to click on this icon on the panel on the right and choose script. Click on this and add the new hotkey on your knock screen. Then you need to choose the key. For example, it will be word S on your keyboard. Yeah, let's choose S. And go to macro editor. Click here. Here it is, macro editor. We will use only two commands for this video. I think it will be enough. Uh, click and delay. You need delay not to make all the clicks in the same time. So it should be one click after uh, 50 milliseconds, second click and uh, so on. I think you got me. The click uh, is on needed coordinates X and Y. You don't need to set it by your hands, write something here, no need. You just need to click on the screen and the coordinates will appear. I'll click, for example, on my avatar in game and it is 85112. Yeah, let's set the phalanx swap to, for example, cavalry wedge. We add this click, then we add delay, save, save, then go here. Open it again, go to our uh, key S and set another click, it will be right here. To change the phalanx, we need to click here. Here is needed coordinates. Choose this, delay, save, save. Click here. Go back. Then we choose needed phalanx, cavalry wedge, plus, delay, and the last pattern will be here. Also add the click, save, save. Let's try. I had only infantry phalanx, range wedge, cavalry wedge, and now I set cavalry, oh, I mean that was cavalry phalanx, yeah. And now we set for cavalry wedge, right? Let's see how it works. Click, one second, and we stay on cavalry wedge right now. Perfect. We can also set a macro on fast TP. Already has it. Check it out. Huh. You're currently in the process of migration. <laughs> okay, let's try again. And the last time. Okay. I will show you also the solo attack with a needed battalion. Uh, let me find a castle. No castles without the shields. Please, something. Okay, I found one. And let's see how it works. I'm clicking on the needed button and sending this battalion. It's, uh, I guess, full range, right? Yeah, it's full range. Then I have a full cavalry. 
my second battalion and full infantry all be the same here are all my macrosis this is uh, how I s I'm sending the battalion in a march very simple just one two three clicks padding swap is four clicks as I remember uh, size will automatically add in this macro editor you don't need to choose the size the size will be choose for you uh, so you just need to uh, use delay click and choose the coordinates that's all you need very very simple if this video was interesting for you push the like button and don't forget to subscribe bye guys see you in the next videos